right now a centennial tribute to that lovable redhead and queen of television comedy, Lucille Ball. Lucille Ball was born exactly 100 years ago on August 6th, 1911 in Jamestown, New York. So in honor of Lucy Centennial, here is the theme song from the I Love Lucy TV show written by Harold Adamson and Elliot Daniel as performed by Sandy and Mike. Sandy, and thank nice you, Mike, here, for helping me celebrate the centennial of Lucille Ball with her theme song. Now, Sandy, I, I know that you as a child actor worked on The Honeymooners, and you also worked on the Sergeant Bilko, Phil Silver's show, but uh, you never did work with Lucille Ball. No, I did not. That's no. because you were in New York. And she was out there in California. That's correct. So just think, okay. if you had been in California, you could have auditioned to play Little Ricky. How long does it take to walk to that's California? Right. <laughs> yeah, but I didn't play drums. Yeah, that's, oh, you didn't play drums. You played, well, maybe they would have changed it for you, you know. And, Mike, I know you're a big fan of the I Love Lucy show. Yes, I like. Give I me your memories of Lucille Ball. Uh, well, of course, I saw them all in reruns, I think. I don't that's think right. That They've been yet. on continuously. They have been on continuously. And um, um, I always used to wonder, the, the biggest thing I used to wonder from when they would, because one would come on from, be, from one season and one would be from another season and I was little, and I would always wonder why on one episode there was a window behind the piano and why another episode there That's wasn't. That's right. Mm -hmm. You're very observant. You're and very observant. It would drive my mother and crazy. And the piano would be in a different place in some of the apartments. But the I Love Lucy show uh, ran from 1951. It debuted in October 1951, which will be 60 years. Lucille Ball began her film shows, I Love Lucy, in 1951, and they ran for six years till 1957. And then they did three years, the Lucy Desi Comedy Hour after that, with Lucille Ball, of course, as Lucy Ricardo, and uh, Desi Arnaz as Ricky Ricardo, and, of course, Mike... The Mertzes. The Mertzes. I love the Mertzes. William Frawley as love Fred Mertz. Bub. And Vivian Vance as Ethel Mertz. As Ethel, yep. And then, of course, later on, Lucy had two more TV series. She had Here's Lucy and The Lucy Show. The Lucy Show in 1962 debuted, and then in 1968, Here's Lucy debuted. And both shows featured the great Gail Gordon. Loved Gail Gordon. Wonderful yeah. character actor who was so funny. But Lucy also had a long movie career before she entered television. She started with Eddie Canner in Roman Scandal. She was a Goldwyn girl. Yes. Beautiful Lucille Ball yeah. was a Goldwyn girl, and that was her first picture with Eddie Canner, Roman Scandals. And then she signed a contract with Columbia, where she appeared as a bit player in many Columbia shorts and features, including one with the Three Stooges. Yeah. <laughs> and then she went over to RKO and signed a contract and became a featured player and co-star, and appeared most notably with the Marx Brothers and Room Service, uh -huh. and with Katherine Hepburn and Ginger Rogers and Stage Door. And her biggest film at RKO was The Big Street, a dramatic film that she made with Henry Fonda. And then after RKO, she moved to MGM and made big budget musicals. And then later, she made four movies with Bob Hope, which were all very, very successful, including The Facts of Life and, of course, the television show. Mm -hmm. And she loved to do, and she worked with all the great comedians in films. I met she her daughter. You met oh, Lucy Arnaz? Lucy, yep. Where and did you her meet husband. Her? Uh, actually, I saw them. Uh, I saw her on Broadway once. Uh, I can't remember the name of the show, but um, they're playing our song. They're playing our song. That's right. I uh, saw her on Broadway, and I actually met her and her husband uh, at the Ren Fair, the Renaissance Fair in New York. Very good. And I also met Lucy Arnaz and her husband Lawrence Lookin' Bell Lawrence a Luckenbell. couple of years ago mm -hmm. at the Friends of Old Time Radio. There you go.